There is no problem with the exposure of light in this scene, however that doesn't mean the lighting can't be improved. This situation contains a mixture of light sources, fluorescent lights from the ceiling above, daylight streaming in through the windows. The colour balance looks awash with green and yellow. We can correct this in terms of the quality of the light to make it far more pleasing to the eye. This is the same scene, now lit so that the lighting complements the situation and draws the attention towards the main subject, which is the young man operating the machinery. If we cut between the unlit shot and the lit shot, you can clearly see the difference that the lighting makes. The lighting for this scene has been achieved using two lights in the dado range, the Pan Hour 5 and the 575 Watt Daylight Softbox. These lights beautifully fill the scene. The quality of the light from the large surface of the Pan Hour 5 wraps around the subject. Each light is fitted with a grid which directs the light towards the main subject. Beyond the main lighting, the background of the scene has also been lit. This makes further detail visible and once again improves the quality of the lighting. Here, a dado light has been positioned to brighten up the detail in the background. If we cut between the lit and the unlit scene, you can see what difference the lighting makes for both the action in the foreground and the detail in the background. The side-by-side -side comparison clearly shows the difference.